Nothing's showing up on the space ring's exterior sensors. Must be the enemy Techno Man. If we don't get to the spaceport number eight before that thing does, we're gonna be stranded. Meanwhile, what's going on with Blade and Balsam? I don't know. I can't find them. The interior sensors are still out of whack. Maggie, isn't there something you can do to fix them? <sighs> Give me a minute. I'm working as fast as I can. <sighs> Restoring communications, weapons, now the sensors. I'm good, but even I can only do one thing at a time. We have no way of knowing if they're even dead or alive. Well, speaking for myself, I'm definitely alive. Balsam! Back. Had my brain scrambled a little bit, but then again, what else is new? But what happened to Blade? If I manage to make it, Blade's bound to be okay. Don't worry, the kid's a whole lot tougher than I am. We just got separated in all the fireworks, that's all. I thought if you guys had the space ring sensors up and running, you might know where he is. Well, are they? Got it. Now let's see if I'm as good as I think. Yep, I am. What? Maggie, you fixed them? If you mean the sensors, of course I fixed them, or at least half of them. We should be able to see anyone in this quadrant of the space ring. Aha! I like the look of those two blips in the outer ring corridor. Let me punch up a visual. Just as I thought, it's Blade and the Technobot. <gasps> And wouldn't you know it, they're headed right for that eight spaceport, and they've got a step on that enemy Technoman. Good going, kid. Okay, let's get out of here. Maggie works better alone. Come on, let's jump into our Techno suits and give Blade some moral support. Technoman, I do not understand why we have stopped. Spaceport number eight is still at risk. Are you having functional difficulties? Techno man. <laughs> Repeat. Are you having functional difficulties, Techno Man Blade? Why are you calling me that robot? I am Pegasus. Look, just back off, will ya? Back off. Affirmative. I shall increase the distance between us by two meters. Listen, Pegasus, or whatever your name is. Oh, never mind. I said back off. What are you following me for? My presence is necessary for you to perform certain functions. What are you talking about? What do I need a robot for? Correction, Technoman Blade. I am not a robot. I am a Technobot. I was created in the Space Knights Research Laboratory. My production number is T3 slash T9 slash Okay, okay. up any enemy activity just blade and the technobot but we can't get to them this way it'll take too long to get past this rubble follow me whoa 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 hang on a minute the spaceport's in the opposite direction believe me i'm aware of that this way is a shortcut oh now i get it we're going to take a little spacewalk huh bingo give that man a prize the way I see it, if we get out onto the surface and cut diagonally across the diameter of the space ring, we'll save a lot of time. And avoid bumping in any more spider crabs. Listen, Ringo, I'm afraid spider crabs may be the least of our problems. Well, whatever. Come on, let's crack this bulkhead door and get moving before that enemy techno man turns spaceport number eight into a disaster area. Hang on to your dentures, it could be a bumpy ride. Oh no, you! All the heck with it!
last spaceport eight. It's like coming home again. But how different it looks from the last time I saw it. Attention, crew of Deep Space Exploration Ship Argos. One hour to launch. Nick, Kane, come and see what Conrad gave Catherine. Hey, does this mean that you're... Yes, I'm going to make Catherine the newest member of the Carter family, if it's all right with you three. You bet it is, brother. Conrad, you lucky dog. I was so sure this was going to happen, I even ordered a wedding cake and had it stowed on board yesterday. Shara, you little <laughs> devil. We were to be married while orbiting Saturn, but it wasn't to be. If we'd arrived in orbit one day later, we never would have encountered that alien probe. But such hypothetical speculation is pointless. What's done is done. I am what I am, and my duty is clear. I must protect Darkon and destroy his enemies. They must not be allowed to reach the moon. Access corridor should lead right to the spaceport. Ah, what was that? My sensors detect a life form in close proximity. Who? Saber? Saber, are you there? There. That should do it. I hope that'll give us some firepower. See if the laser cannon will respond now. Nice work, Maggie. The laser cannon should be coming online just about... Yep, that's it. So far, so good. Now aim for that abandoned weather satellite. Starboard heading, point eight mark three. Roger. All cannon responding well. Now triangulating on target at mark T-9 or beta. was that? Watch yourselves. Could be a surprise attack. Negative. That was only me doing a weapons check. Everything seems fine. Great, but how about a little warning next time, huh? Maggie, we're a blade in the enemy Technoman now. Spaceport 8 virtually on top of each other. I'm getting huge energy readings coming from there, so you better hurry up. Too late. This spaceport was our last chance. <laughs> Welcome, Blade. What took you so long? Who... who were you? No, he's mine. No! I should be the one fighting him. Release me, Darkon. He's my brother and I must destroy him. It's my destiny. Please, Darkon, set me free! The crystal to transform. Huh? Crystal, it's it's gone. Technoman Blade, I will open the interlock chamber on your command. I've lost the emerald crystal. Without it, I'm I'm, I'm useless. It's it's got to be around here somewhere. It's got to be. What's wrong with you? Have you forgotten how to transform into a Technoman? Forgotten? Of course not. But I need the crystal. Where is it? I I've never lost it before. He's worse than I thought. Perhaps I won't have to destroy him. Technoman Blade, your crystal was damaged. I am your means of achieving techno transformation. I will perform that function upon your command. Stand up, Nick Carter. Stop groveling on your knees like a slave. Yes, my name is Nick Carter. And you, you are Catherine. That's right, Nick. Your brother Kane is with me. We miss you. It's wrong when friends and families fight among themselves. Come join us, Nick. Together nothing in the universe can stop us. Look, there he is! What's he doing? No! Huh? You're not my 
family. You destroyed my family. I see I was wasting my time. You've chosen to stay among the humans. You can't even remember how to become a techno man anymore. Well, that just makes my job easier. about barging in like that, but I couldn't find the doorbell. <sighs> Thanks, Star. These pea shooters are worthless. We might as well be throwing spitballs at her. Yeah, but if we use ion cannons, we risk tearing up the spaceport even more. We've got to try to drive her back. Uh-oh. <laughs> so much for that idea. Let's take this fight outside. Ringo, you're in my line of fire. Get out of the way. <laughs> Very pretty, but you'll have to do better than that. Star, I don't know what to do. I've lost the crystal. What do you mean, Blade? What are you talking about? He has forgotten that the crystal is now installed within this entity. What? No! Why are you looking at me like that? I didn't mean to lose it. It just vanished. Blade, you didn't lose it. It was shattered. Ugh. The pieces were reformed inside the Technobot. With it, you can still become a Technoman. I don't understand. I don't remember. Star, I'm lost. You've got to help me. Tell me how to do it. Wait. Perhaps it's better this way. The techno transformation only makes your condition worse. Maybe if you didn't ever become a technomat again, you'd no. be better. No, no, don't say that. I have to destroy them. Time to finish what we started, Nick. Huh? Get out, Star! Blade! If he doesn't transform, he won't have a chance. Reinitialize engagement systems to respond to my voice. Reinitializing systems. Gotcha. Oh. Hang on to her, Rico. You fools! Technobot, open interlock chamber. Affirmative. Get away, you ass! Now then, traitor, it's just you and me. Huh? What? Interlock chamber open. Ready for you. You still want to play? Be careful, Blade. You and Darkon have taken everything from me. Everything except this burning hatred. That I'll never lose. <gasps> Life means nothing. I must destroy the traitor and protect Darkon, regardless of what happens to me. No sword, save yourself. Get out now. Darkon! Whatever it was, it finished the job on Spaceport 8. That's where they are! Ringo, come in! Are you guys all right? Affirmative. Baltac, Star, and I are still in one piece. I'm not so sure about Blade. And I'm afraid the decorators made a real mess of the Spaceport. Blade. What use am I? I do more harm than good. My memory, it gets more undependable every day. I'm losing control. I'm scared, Star. Maybe I should just give up. No, no! Don't give up! You can't give up! Hang on to me! I'm here! I'll always be here! Just hang on to me, Blade! Hang on tight! The 
traitor still lives, but the last spaceport our enemies could have used to reach me here on the moon has been destroyed. You have done well, Sword. I never would have survived but for you. You called out to me, told me to save myself. And why not? I have no wish to lose you. Now that our enemy's plans have been overturned, I have the time I need to finish my preparations. Soon the mothership will be ready to descend upon the planet below, and I with it. But until then, I must have peace. You will release Saber at once. Yes. But why, Darkon, when you have me to serve you? Nothing must be allowed to interrupt me before I have regained my full strength. If Saber is willing to pay the ultimate price, then I am willing to sacrifice one brother to destroy another. Release him! Very well. Darkon, why have you done this to me? Let me out. I swear I will go mad in this place. Release me. Allow me the powers that Blade has, and I will defeat him, I promise you. Darkon would have destroyed you, but I convinced him to give you another chance, if you're willing to take it. <laughs> willing? Are you joking? How can I be anything else? My life has no other purpose. Even at the cost of your own life? Yes. Yes! So be it. I only hope you don't come to regret your decision. <laughs> I'll have the powers Blade has. Yes, but why you want them is beyond my understanding. It's madness to forfeit your life for a vendetta. Not madness. Destiny. <laughs>